Hello everyone and welcome back to my Burgundians campaign in Total War Attila. My name is Ben Pope on Ben Pope Games. We left off, it's been a couple of days, but we left off with our um, faction leader here, Jebika, going over to uh, land, possibly here, but he's got to go around. He's going to land there and... Um, Yeah, he's in double time. Okay, and he's gonna go attack the Geats because the Geats wanted war. Uh, so I, I guess we're just gonna go fight them. We were chasing the um, what's left of the Rugens over here, uh, but they're just running around doing nothing. So I'm gonna bring this army back, and my uh, fleet is kind of here in, in case I need to react and I may be able to single out some of these guys that are just uh, men on boats in transports versus actual fleets see the actual fleets don't have that symbol there that's on top of this Your orders? they have seasickness because they're um, inexperienced with with sailing so various penalties if you get caught out there and have to fight um, Otherwise, we can spend some money. This granary is going to finish. And I think I'm going to build the great hall here that will make me let me unlock a noble Germanic swordsman and will give me some public order. Um, I was going to get the warrior's hold, but actually getting the warrior's hold in the capital, which is this I wish I could change the capital so it's the bigger city but getting the warrior hold there allows you to uh, level it to the max level so we're gonna get the great hall here and when this slot becomes available um, right now we have a farm there so yeah we have two farms but they're different farms so we, we're getting um, well, we just unlocked Barb Javelin from both of them. But that's okay. Alright, uh, that's about it for this turn. I don't think I need to do anything. Everything's fine here. Uh, my faction leader still doesn't have a wife. But you know what? That's that's fine. You don't, don't need a wife. Apparently. Apparently you're going to be alone. He he has tried to get married a few times and he got rejected. And so, I um I gave him my best advice that you know. At at this point, we're just gonna make you look like a super great man, out on the battlefield, and then some house, some faction out there is gonna be like, oh man, he's a bad beast. We should marry our uh, one of our daughters to him and then he will totally like I don't know he'll make like super crazy good fighting kids like their kids are gonna be badass so that's what's gonna happen that's so many units the treasury is buckling under the weight of their upkeep capturing quiet old man all right so um somebody is withholding taxes my lord as one of your tax collectors I must report that one some citizens have been withholding payment of your just taxes, engaging faction politics to deal with this manner. Um, I think we're going to talk to them because sending in the troops is a bit. And this is the, this is like the first, you know, mistake they've made. I guess haven't really had problems with taxes before. Uh, we're gonna. Uh, this will add more squalor. We're gonna wait for this to get. Um, a well here, and then we can upgrade the goat herd. That's just public order. Yeah, squalor there. Okay. Same with this. Um. Okay, and then this I can get more sanitation, but it will be just for the capital, which I might need it, but not at 
this moment. Should we convert that to something else? Could definitely use Mounted Brigands or Onager and hun Hunters. Let's see. That will give us Onager, large Onager at the end there. The Smithy is gonna give us uh, Burgundian Axemen. And mounted brigands, bone carver won't give us any infantry or cavalry or nothing. Same with the wicker maker, basket weaver and stuff, and then the clay pit, which you know these do give a lot more wealth. But I'm uh, guessing this is it's a good idea to get the mounted brigands and the axemen. So we're gonna convert this no <laughs> convert button and go to Smithy. And that's all the money I'm gonna spend. Uh you guys should hurry up and Oh it's winter. Hmm Can we Let's just go over here. Your next command. I really don't want to be on the land there and take a bunch of uh, attrition. So let's wait. A, well, let's wait a bit. It's October, uh, and we're gonna have a backup. <laughs> backup. All right, and we're you're gonna take attrition for being out here. So, and next like trying to find where that I see a border. The other border is probably the river. Yeah. Um, I think you should stay put. If you go into here, see attrition, immune to swamp, snow, desertion. Hmm. Okay, let's have you immune to attrition for a bit. Okay, let's end the turn. I, I wasn't aware that winter is coming. Somebody should have told me this. Yes, nobody from the wall came down and said, oh my goodness, winter is coming. I wonder if the Danes are going to help with uh, fighting those other dudes. They might have the Geats attack me. Because they can, obviously. The Geats are looking to attack me. Uh, Rugians are most likely going to take that town, but I don't really care about that. Uh, please do comment below with your thoughts about how this is going. I know it's a fresh um, uh -huh, influence. Good. The villagers agree to peacefully pay. I don't see any more money in my coffers. Than what I had before, so uh, yeah, you guys are gonna have to double time it. If you double time it, you'll get close. Maybe we w One for sure is that I could, um. They're already on double time. I could go get their city now that, that nobody's there. So we're gonna double time it back with the howling waves and uh, get, get
get close. And you guys are gonna have to. Um, mouse is doing the skitty thing again. You guys are gonna have to hook it through the winter. Sorry about that. <laughs> that was huge. Uh, damage there. And we trespassed, and Ebo regained the rank. So let's let's do his rank up here. He's gonna get Wolf, and he's gonna get. I feel like I should get Hunter. Just because extra food won't hurt, and the Geats, um, these aren't the Geats, the Burgundians have pretty darn good uh, you know, skirmisher units, that's what I'm trying to say. Okay, so I can replace my Levy Spearman if I get that one. I can get Burgundian Guards or Recruitment Cost Let's uh, let's change out the Spears Seem more useful Alright Ibor, healer of Godan. Uh, you could almost make it into town, huh? Oh man, he's gonna take some attrition. All right. Your next command. That's okay. It's okay, because we're going to do the same with these guys. We're going to uh, not double time it. And then we can't do anything. Shoot. Alright. Yeah, let's see what happens. Uh, that's all I got to say. And I'm going to take a sip of coffee while this is happening. Right, so do um, leave a comment and hey, thank you. Leave a comment and, and let me know. Jeez, uh, that wasn't good at all. <laughs> let me know what um, you think. Um, do share this out if you think other people you may know uh, would enjoy these types of videos. I'm kind of doing let's plays because I didn't have much I don't have a lot of time to get into like really super creative stuff so let's plays are um, are good for now and um, yeah hit the like button any of those things that you can do to help uh, popularity grow for my channel would be good everybody's taking attrition um, Ebor could go in the town at regular pace. Uh, this guy, this guy will go in the town. I'm thinking, I'm thinking these guys are gonna attack me, so, um, the blood axes the Danes might not have enough forces alright uh, let's let's pretend like we're how far can we go in hmm Ready for battle. let's just do sort of a raid. Uh, 
Yeah, I don't know if that's gonna help me, but sure, I'll make some money off of that. I think I can kill off one of these guys, but I can't because I'm in Force March. Being Force March, does that. So the problem I'm having is I could I could actually just recruit people, maybe mercenaries. I have money, right? To fight these guys off. Um, he's by himself, and these are just armies. Okay. So what we will do is we will raise a fleet. Looks like Zoto is a defender, a fighter, fearless warrior. All of these are other nobles. And then we have our... I think this is our heir. But might be mistaking. So let's get, um, let's get the Fearless Warrior and raise a fleet. Ready. And the uh, Sailors of the Broken Dawn. But that's... Not a bad name, I guess. Okay, and you, sir, are gonna... Uh, I'm not sure if you should hire mercenaries. But... You should definitely get... Some dramatic marauders. And some... Uh, of these guys. The ramming dudes. Do I want more? Yes. Ready for battle. I'm pretty sure that he's gonna attack me right away. So here we have two barb javelins, one scatter shot. Let's Death get a Germanic warband and uh, I really want a mounted brigand right now. More war bands. And let's get some some mercenaries. Mounted bows. They're one seventy two per turn, so that's when one sixty five. These guys are cheap, so that guy's not cheap. And this guy's Kinda not cheap. Um, and you are also not cheap. So okay, um, if they attack me right away, I'll have these mercenaries. If not, I'll have um, more people because of that. So, uh, and I'll have these. Yeah, I'm not going to get mercenary boats, I don't think. Let me see. Mercenary. Marauders. Bite marauders. They're cheap, so let's get them. Let's get them. Okay, so this is defended. Uh, this is not defended. So... What do I do about these guys? Do I just attack them? Here. Alright, I took the mercenaries. <laughs> Shoot. Danes, I'm trying to help you out. What's it gonna be? For the tribe. Right, uh, so we're... We're gonna help each other if they attack us here. Uh, I'm guessing I should recruit regular units here too. Let's see, let's get on the hurler and 
because they're cheap. And let's get another Spearman. Yay. Uh, so, you know, I thought I was going to have a fight, but obviously I'm not having a fight. And something happened here with the Danes and, and, the, and the Geats, and I would like to know what it is, but it seems like I won't find out. Are they going to, like, la land... On land to try to get me because that would be great. Okay, attrition. Okay, so the Danes did not lose their city. That's good. Uh, it's time, boys. It's time. I wasted all this money to uh, come and get you, so we're going to come and get you. Uh, that might be a mess, they might still take their city there, but you know what, uh, this is this is something that we got to do. So they're going to run off. Chickens. All right, so it's not. Um, it's not winter anymore. So let's go in here, guys. Let's see. I don't have a spy, so the problem is I'm gonna get there and I'm gonna get like stupefied. And yes, that's a term. Um, so they run away. I'm gonna. Pull over here, Your orders? and we're gonna Row, curse you. Row. pull over here. Did I, did I have any? I didn't have. Uh, these guys had mercenaries. Gonna get rid of the mercenaries. Ready for battle. Those three guys. Okay, um, and we're you know losing money right now, which is stupid. But I think I'm gonna go help out. Um, can't really help them out, can I? I'm gonna try really quick to get a defensive alliance, but I don't think I have military Greetings, access. Friend. I've called for good ale to ease your throat and pa ripe women to ease other parts. Alright, so No. <laughs> Ready for um, orders. I need I need to climb on. So I guess I can only go there. On the move, lads. Risk the sky. Disembarking now. Just kind of stupid because that's like a f full army of uh, he kind of beat up dudes. So maybe you can do something. Warriors all. Maybe. I doubt he's going to attack me. Uh, Mercenary Nordic Brigade. That's 67. It's like stupid not to take him. Uh, Germanic Hoarders, Herders, 86, 89. And that's too expensive. Look at that, 1,000. These guys are expensive, so we're not going to get those guys. Right, so that's going to be a fight. This maybe will be a fight. And then that's definitely going to be something. 
um, let's end the, the turn again. I gotta do something about. Ready for order. Something about all this money I'm throwing away. I get rid of the levy here. And possibly build something. And I need to build a well. So that's 1200. And I think I, I must I must be close to taking out the gates. I'm gonna end this turn. Uh, see what moves they take. And... I don't know. Let me, uh, in the comments. Oops. So we're gonna have to fight this. Because they did that. Um, I'm gonna leave this for the next episode because I'm out of time. Personally, I have to get somewhere. But uh, let me know if I should uh, take over the land of the Geats or make them a client state. When I when I take their land, that's my question there. So, um, we're definitely gonna continue this right here, and we have to fight. And I don't know how good the AI is gonna do um, with that many units, but you know, I wish they had this many units too. That would have been easier, easier. But they just have like. Um, some skirmisher and a Nordic band and Hegel, Helgi. All right, so <laughs> Helgi, the Dane, and Ivor, healer of Godan from the Burgundians, will team up next time to take on this sort of rugged. This should be an easy fight. They just have these these guys that are healthy. Everybody else is kind of dead. So I'll see you guys soon. Don't forget to hit the like button, comment, and do subscribe if you're not subscribed and you like what's on my channel. I'll see you guys yeah. soon. Bye.